Hello and welcome to Don't Believe the Hype and this very special episode that might see the light of day, it might not. Anything could happen in the next half an hour, as they said on some TV show from years ago. We are doing the World Cup of Arctic Monkey songs to tie in with the Football World Cup that is coming up soon. So to tell us more and to set the ball rolling. Ball, because we have balls in the draw, that's good, that. To set the oh, ball rolling. The sound it, effects, it, don't you? Yeah, oh, it's this sound effects, <laughs> it's all be. happening. <laughs> what, what, is, what is the plan, then? What is happening? So, yeah, we're going to run alongside the normal World Cup. Um, with our Arty Monkeys Songs World Cup. So we're going to take every single Arty Monkeys song, uh, apart from the Beneath the Bodwork demos and apart from any covers that they did. So just all Arty Monkeys songs and B-sides that have been officially released. And there's 117. So we're going to, um, I'm going to do a schedule. We're just going to run alongside the games that you'll see on TV. There will be more games in the schedule here. So there's eight groups in a World Cup because there's 32 teams. We need nine groups and there'll be 13 songs per group because obviously there's more Arctic Monkey songs than there are teams in the World Cup by quite a wide margin. So uh, we're going to do a schedule and we'll be tweeting out. We'll be going to social media, Instagram, Twitter, uh, all of them, yeah. We'll be, we'll be putting them out there and you can vote. So every every time there's a game scheduled on, we'll be tweeting out the same time as the game, probably multiple votes. The winner from that game, the votes, who, which song gets the most votes, goes through to the, obviously it gets the most point in the group and then it'll go through to the round of 16, quarterfinals, semifinals, until we have an audience voted World Cup winning Arctic Monkey song. And I have included the car on this. It's been out a month now, nearly. So well worth people, I'm sure, will have their favourites and be able to compare it. So yeah, what we're going to do now is, rather excitedly, we're going to have a World Cup draw. So we're going to draw out, um, Nick is going to draw out a random number from between 1 and to, to 117. I'll tell us the corresponding song for that and we're going to add the songs to the groups and we'll see what difficult groups we get and if there's any clear winners that we think in each group. Without further ado, could you give me the first number in the draw for Group A? The first number in the draw is number 115. Hello, you. Rather interestingly there, hello, you. So what is the second song to join that in the group A? The second song, Dan, is 38. That is the frame two. Ah, ooh, uh, a classic V-side, I would say. Uh, one of my favourites from my youth, <laughs> that oh, yes. one. Um, could we now have the third track of Group A? <laughs> okay, so I just want to explain what we've done here. We had a plan where we were going to, and um, we were going to go through, as you've seen, all the tracks, and um, pull them out with the, <laughs> pull them out in a very, you know, FA Cup draw, World Cup draw style. And we realized that that was dull as dishwater for you to watch and listen to actually in action. So we did that first group and then we thought, you know what, we're just going to do it and we're going to fast forward it. So what we're going to do instead is we're just going to go through the groups, have a brief little chat about them. 13 tracks obviously don't make a good round of 16 because, I mean, it doesn't make a good like games because there's you need an even amount of teams and 13 is an odd number. So what we're going to do is in each group is pick one track that we're going to put automatically through to the next round Ooh. and then yeah exciting and then and then they'll be in the automatically in the the round of 16 group a was the one that you did here before we decided that was absolute nonsense to make you sit through that you know we couldn't get rod stewart in to actually do it and make even those actual draws are dull aren't they so i don't know why i thought it would be exciting because they're always dull aren't they like um do you remember when we were kids and the only way to know the footy scores was on the tv and the guy would be like forest one Newcastle five, and it would just be going down. Like two hours. Hours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. your, dad, your dad's just anxiously waiting for that one to come out, so he knows if he's lost yeah. all your all your like, family savings on the yeah. <laughs> yeah. group group A. Hello, you, the frame to R, the Hellcat Spangled Shalala, Potion Approaching, Pretty Visitors, Science Fiction, Sketchhead, Matador, Plastic Tramp, Suck It and See. Number one party anthem, Balaclava, and do me a favor. You can't make me choose one of them to automatically go through. <laughs> it's a good group, isn't it? I'm I'm gonna put for it's between for me, it's 
Oh, right, Suck It and See is my favourite Arctic Monkeys song of all time. Mm. But I'm not going to make you put that through on that basis. So the, the ones that I would narrow it down to from that are probably Pretty Visitors, uh, Suck It and See, Number One Party Anthem, and Do Me a Favour are probably the four yeah. that I think. Unless That's you the four, agree yeah. Us, yeah. So what, what, would, uh, what would your heart of heart say if you had to put one automatically through to the... The golden buzzer, the golden buzzer in it. <laughs> <laughs> no, this, is, oh, this, this is like choosing between all my favourite cheeses. <laughs> I'm having an awful Red time La- here. Red Leicester. It's not an Artie Monkey song, that's my favourite cheese. <laughs> it's not a B-side for the, it's not a B-side for the car, you know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Yet. We don't do, know yet. Do, 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 do. Red Leicester. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't the English countryside. Oh, <laughs> oh, okay. I'm tempted to yep. go for Pretty Visitors. So I would go suck it and see, but Pretty Visitors would be my my close one behind it. So in the interest oh, of, I'd not... go suck it and see as well. I, I would go suck it and see first. But yeah, would you? Would you allow me suck it and see? And then because your your favourite song going to come at some point, and I'll have to allow you then to put that through. I guess. Um, so in yeah, the interest I'm, of I'm that, getting my, I'm getting my favours done, so I can call them in. Okay. Later. Okay. Yeah, you got your favours. Okay, we'll put suck it and see through then. So yes, that one's through, and the rest will all compete to get through. Um, so we're doing the games the same. So it's like November twenty first are the first games of the World Cup. So we'll put out a couple of games that day. November twenty fifth is the next. Thing. I think the groups end on November 29th, and then we'll have our round of sixteen. And then we have Group B is American Sports, Frightline Dining Room, I Want It All, Mardi Bum, That's Where You're Wrong, You're So Dark, Mad Sounds. Red light indicates doors are secured. You're probably blah, blah, blah. IDST, The Afternoon's Hat, Body Paint, and Tranquility Base Hotel and Casino. Just when you thought the group was slightly easier at the end, they throw two. It's going to be um, sick. <laughs> it's difficult because at first you think, well, Mardi Bum. And then you think, yeah. ooh, Body Paint. I really like that. Or Tranquility, though. Um, I like American sports, personally, a lot as well. But I wouldn't, yeah, fight, I wouldn't, I wouldn't fight for it in the as the one that goes through. But... But um, if I was picking, I'm working on the basis as well that I can see what those games might be. If we, so I know that some of them might win their games probably. But um, but but also like, <laughs> yeah, this is like this, um, I was going to say, this isn't how the World Cup works. But it's this exactly is how the World Cup works. <laughs> yeah, it's corrupt. I've turned into Seb Blatter. Oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bribes and corruption. No, no. Um, I I, I was thinking Marty Bum, but I, I kind of want to see the listeners. Scrap over Marty Bum. So, um, yeah, I do. I, I'm gonna. I would say oh, that's where your wrongs in there as well. But, but no, mm. there's a couple of B sides in there I really like as well. But I can't be putting Frightline Dining Room in just because I like it. But I'm gonna say Tranquility or Body Pain. I... <laughs> no, you know what? It's but, been but, around longer. But the, I got Tranquility, but there's a world where sometimes American Sports is my favorite song on that album. Yeah, yeah, um, same. So, so I would put that through as well. Right. Tranquility. Tranquility isn't one of my four. I, I I do really like the song Tranquility Base, don't get me wrong, but it's not like um I prefer like four star four out of five, for example, or or many others on the album. Tranquility wouldn't be in my top five on the album, I don't think, actually. Tranquility. Even though I really like it. And I do really like it. Oh. Sophie's choice, you isn't know, it? You know what? It's, it's, it's horrible. It's you know, harder, you know what harder, than, it's harder than Sophie's choice. There's just a couple of little. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Just a couple, You can have more kids. We from. can't write more Arctic Monkeys songs. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we tried. <laughs> we tried and failed spectacularly. Uh, um, <laughs> the other you know, you know what? <laughs> this might be controversial, but I'm going to go for body paint. I want to see. I want to see my favorite current big hitter up against some of the others in the next round. I could go body paint. It was it was between that tranquility and American sports, so I'll go body paint. In fact, I need to make a note of these. I'll forget. I'll forget one sec. <laughs> <laughs> if, only there was, uh, if only there was some way you could go back and watch what we've chosen. Good point. Yeah, good, good <laughs> point. Um, idiot again. Uh, group C is, so we'll put body paint through on that one, so that goes through to the finals. Uh, group C is Teddy Picker, Only Ones Who Know, Why Do You Only Call Me When You're High, Stop the World, I Want to Get Off With You, Fireside, The Blondo Sonic Shimmer Trap, Old Yellow Bricks, Fake Tales, Dance, uh, Better Look on the Dance Floor, All My Own Stunts, Are You Mine, Fluorescent Adolescent, If You Were There, Beware. Uh, 
Now, my instant knee-jerk reaction to that incredible group of songs is, <laughs> I, mean, I mean, it's going to be like the most groups in it, to be fair, but is that um, I would put Are You Mine through, but I know that's probably going to, that's a potential winner of the whole thing, so to give it a head start might be a little bit, a little bit like yeah. ne- needless, really. And you know what this, I mean? But, but then again, you got, you got, don't you say Fake Tales was in there? I've just seen the game. Can I just give you one of the games that, that, Oh, is that oh, is that is that insider trading? I don't know. Yeah, it's insider no, no, trading. I should I shouldn't know. No, because you would know the games from the schedule. Yeah, you yeah. Natural, yeah, cool. wouldn't you? So just I'll let you know the, the draw gave Are You Mine up against Fluorescent Adolescent in the, done with the stakes. <laughs> <laughs> what what have you done to me? <laughs> This is the worst day ever. You're gonna, you're gonna have to, see, you're gonna have to see a, a, a song you don't think is good enough win the World Cup on the final this day, and see England lose a World Cup final. <laughs> if we're even there, which we won't be. Um... <laughs> this, this, this is gonna be like when Greece won the won the Euros in 2004. <laughs> right, we'll just we'll just change it last minute. It'll be like, and the winner is La La Land. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that's a tough one. Are you mind for that lesson in it for the fans? So we could either save one of them. From such turmoil, but if we remove one, I'll let you know now. The song that the the one would replace it with to be up against will be "If You Were There, Beware." But I think "Are You Mine?" If I listen, would still win over that with the fans. So I could be wrong, but so we could save one of them from possible relegation from the tournament, or we could pick a different one. The other one that I'd probably go for from there. I mean, "Are You Mine?" is probably the best song in that list, just just in terms of. It's a fucking great song. That's adolescent though. Dance floor. I probably wouldn't save that. Why do you want to come when you're high? I think these are all going to be good ones. Fireside. See, I, mean, I love Fireside. fireside. I, I'm, yeah, I love Fireside. Well, we could leave. I mean, it's a good battle. We want to leave some good battles for the fans. So, are you mind? First adolescent is like a, you know, that is an ultimate game, isn't it? That's like, I don't know, Brazil versus. It's going to be a big, big upset there either way. <laughs> Brazil versus another Brazil team <laughs> is what that's like. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I'd go with Fireside, you know. I would save Fireside from that. Or Fake Tales, if you wanted to save that, we could save. Uh, oh. I'll, I'll let you have the casting vote on this one. Another save Fake Tales. Save Fake Tales. Another favour. Oh, there we go. Let's, let's, save Fake Tales. Save Fake Tales, yeah. So we save Fake yeah. Tales in that. Okay. Group D is I Want to Be Yours, Crying Lightning, Don't Sit Down Because I've Moved Your Chair, Fire in the Fud, Star Treatment, Bigger Boys and Stolen Sweethearts, Knee Socks, Riot Van, The Bakery, Bat Phone, Perfect Sense, Catapult, and Sticking to the Floor. <laughs> Um, well, the, if we're going to go with what song I think is my favourite on there, well, Crying Lightning's great, but you know what I would save in that, actually? Star Treatment. Because I think it's going to get an unfair rap, but I love it. I yeah. think it's an absolute yeah. banger. I'd save yeah, Star, Treatment. Star Treatment. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to go Star Treatment. Do yeah. That. Done. Excellent. Okay, so Group E. Uh, Big Ideas. Love is a Laser Quest. Cigarette Smoker Fiona. A Certain Romance. Cornerstone. Don't forget whose legs you're on. <laughs> from the rich to the rubble, the view from the afternoon, this house is a circus. One for the road, Mr. Schwartz, still take you home. Who the fuck are Arctic Monkeys? Oh, I see Cornerstone's in there, but Cornerstone uh-huh. will do well without our help. <laughs> I would I would personally save Love is a Laser Quest. But Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that's <laughs> one of my favourites ever. So Yes. And I kind of want to give a helping hand to old Mr. Schwartz, pottering around in the back doing his, you know, putting the dubbing yeah. on his shoes. And <laughs> um, <laughs> but, 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 you know, it's I can't fight for any of the newer ones really too much. So I would save Love is a Laser Quest personally. But I'll, on this one, I'll let you, because I know you've got yeah. certain romance in there, Cornerstone, they're all favourites of yours. Certain romance in Cornerstone, I think, will do quite well without, without our helping hand. So, yeah, I agree with you. Love is a Laser Quest. Yes, please. Excellent. Group F, the world's first ever monster trunk, sorry, monster truck front flip. Uh, too much to ask. Sculptures of anything goes. 2013, library pictures, no buses. What if you were right first time? Chun Li's spinning bird kick. Perhaps vampires is a bit strong, but joining the dots, dance little liar. 
um, Mirrorball, that better be a Mirrorball, and Little Illusion Machine with the Wirral Riddler himself. Oh. Um, I personally would pick 2000 and Fur. No, I'm joking. I yeah, would go, I would actually save Too Much to Ask because I think that's a great tune. Or Chun Li's Spinning Bird Kick because it ain't going to get very <laughs> far. And I'd love to see that milling about in the round of 16, to be honest. But... <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Show me your special gets, like, moves. <laughs> imagine that gets like a favorable draw and gets to like the semi final or something. <laughs> it wins. <laughs> If yeah, that wins yeah. and England win the World Cup on the same day, I might just end it there. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so I would love to see that floating about, but if it weren't that, actually, what if you're right first time, you know? I've got a lot to say on that song. Too Much to Ask is, is I love that song. It's beautiful. A mutual yeah, friends gathering. More. I mean, that's bakery that you're singing for a I'm singing bakery. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can I go back and save the bakery? <laughs> well, the, thing, <laughs> the thing about too much to ask is it. Uh, the thing about the bakery is if it, if I, even if I sing it, it probably won't sing me. <laughs> <laughs> Dreadful. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God, I like um, uh, yeah, yeah, I think I think too, too much, much to ask about Chun Li. I'm kind of tempted by Chun Li though, just to see it in that semi final. Just shake about, things up. Not semi final, just in yeah, in the round of sixteen, just to yeah. see it. Like, but then I think it's just going to get beat by whatever it goes up against. Probably, it's, it's going to have like an embarrassing defeat in it. Probably Norwich. They turn up every year. Never going to win the league, are they? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, what do you call it? Bungie, Bungie Club. And uh, two. Too much to ask, I would put through because I think it, it could be a let's just say title contender. Then what's going on? Um, it could be a, a title contender, I think, it could slip through into like the semis or something. Oh, kinky, yeah, <laughs> yes, yeah I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm very happy with too much to ask. It'd be nice, okay. it'd be nice to see that because I, I, I think the fans would be quite happy with that. Did skip over world's first ever monster truck front flip, which I do I know, we, I know we both love so. Yeah, I don't know if yeah. it will do well. Actually, will that do well? Don't know. I'd, I'd forgot. I'd forgotten that was in the list. That's why I was so fixated. On oh too much no! To I'm, I'm, I'm going monster truck front flip. So I'm, I'm going monster I've, truck front flip. I, I, well. I myself, I myself have done a front flip. And Let's do it. Yeah, we've that. done a U turn. Yeah. We're, we're like the British government. <laughs> yeah, world oh, political. Oh. <laughs> Kinky. <laughs> uh, the world's first ever monster truck front flip. We'll put through. Cool. It'll be little illusion machine versus too much to ask, which means that that's probably likely to win. Too much to ask, and it? it's not going to be miles. Or it might do. So we'll have to see what the Wirral Riddler can do. That'd be an int- interesting Wirral, one. That will the Wirral wriggle his way out of that one. Group G. Last two groups. I ain't quite where I think I am. The car. Reckless serenade. You and I. Four out of five. One point perspective. Brian Storm. The jeweler's hands. Do I want to know the nettles, the ultra cheese, jet skis on a moat, secret door? If if I was horrible one, yeah, (laughs) it isn't it because it's full of like little ones that might not make it through, but but you want to. That's what makes it worse. I would personally. So I have a deep love. I mean, I do love the car and stuff, but I'm going to park car tracks for now because they're they're new to the new to the scene. Uh, Um, but so I really love Reckless Serenade. Four out of five, I think I'll do all right. I love One Point Perspective. Will it do all right, do you think? Will it make it? Is it strong enough out there in the world? I don't know. But um, Brian Storm, the jeweler's hands. Brian Storm will be fine, obviously. Jeweler's hands, I love that song. The Ultra Cheese, though. I, I know we both very much love I, the Ultra Cheese, and I don't know if it it's will survive. It do. I don't know what people think of the Ultra Cheese out there in the universe so i think it's one of the m- more liked ones on the album isn't it for people that don't like the album so i think so yeah so maybe it'll be all right maybe it'll be all right uh, if i was if i had to pick one now i think i'd go i got a fear that one point perspective won't make it through and i love that song should, should we do one point yeah it's your yeah, favorite song come up yet yeah oh, yeah yeah, you didn't pick it, did you? You could, have, you could have called that in. No, because I think it's, I think it's going to do fine on its own. It's going to do fine, fine on its own. own. Yeah, I'm tempted with Reckless Serenade, but I think it might mm. be all right. But um, I'm going to go Brian. No, not Brian. One point perspective, yeah? Should we do it? It's Brian, Brian Storm's going to be fine. It's a, Brian yeah, Storm's going to be fine, yeah. Fine it's it yeah, be. one point perspective for me. One point perspective. Just, just for the solo. Yeah. Ugh, what a song. Yeah. And then the last group... Last group of this. Uh, oh no, there's still another one after that. There's the yeah, I forget. So anyway, two last ones now. When the sun goes down, she looks like fun. Black treacle, brick by brick, golden trunks, 
Temptation greets you like your naughty friend. Seven, dangerous animals. D is for dangerous. Evil twin. The death ramps. If you found this, it's probably too late, and I haven't got my strange. I got a feeling you're going to call in a favour on this one. I mean, the meme answer would be for Brick by Brick. You know, the ultimate meme song. That, that, that big, but <laughs> Piss everyone. I, I kind of want to call... I want to call him a favour for either She Looks Like Fun or Black Tree Cool. Oh, I thought you were going to call him a favour for Evil Twin. I love Evil Twin. I do, I do, but I, I don't think it would be fair for me to fair on the you, voters for me to put um, that forward. I love both those songs, so you can have either of those. So I'll let you decide. If you wanted me to give you a nudge, then I'd probably prefer... <sighs> no, I can't, I can't answer that. So I'll let you... I'm, I'm going She Looks Like Fun. Yeah, I probably would have lived towards that. I've just thought of the little solo bit in the middle. Because I think, I think, and this is not me being disparaging about the song because I love it, but I think of all the, the melodic songs that I love on Socket and See as my favourite album, I think Black Tree Cole might be one of the least ones that I love out of all the others. It's lower down on that list. Not to say I give, well, not it, love it, but it, it doesn't make it into like the... favourite lyrics, so... That's the problem, yeah. I know yeah. what that lyric probably is as well. Let's go, She Looks Like Fun. Because I do absolutely love I've, that song. Absolutely uh, slaps. Yeah. Ooh, I can't wait to discuss that one. The last group. So she looks like fun for that one. Last group is Bad Woman. Um, Dancing Shoes. Despair in the Departure Lounge. Leave Before the Lights Come On. Bad Thing. 505. My Propeller. She's Thunderstorms. Power Driver Waltz. Electricity. Arabella snap out of it and anyways if i had to pick one to save if i had to sorry if i had to narrow it down to two to save i'd save either pile driver waltz or mm. anyways because i really love anyways and i don't think it's going to get anywhere in this competition it's not going to get anyways in this competition but but okay. but like but but pile driver waltz would be that's one of my favorite lyrical um should be a um, breakup song that people go on about like they go on about fucking Goodell, but it's not. Yes. Anyway, anyway, I I can happily concur with. I mean, as much as I love anyways as well, but yeah, Pile Driver Waltz. I think it, but that was the one that jumped out at me the most out of all of them. Cool. There's that one then. We'll do Pile Driver Waltz. You'll see from the twenty first onwards, we'll be putting the games on socials every day. In conjunction with Arctic Monkeys US. We'll see the games going out. There'll be several games on November 21st, several on November 25th, and several on November 29th. Then we'll get through to the round of 16. So every games, all the games will follow the dates that the games for the World Cup are on leading up to that big final on, I believe, the 18th of December, I think. And where we'll have whatever those songs may be. Um, if I had to, if you had to guess what those songs, two songs would be before we sign off, what would you say? I'd say the two final songs are going to be Are You Mine? versus 505 i think it'll be do i want to know against 505 Ooh, interesting yeah both yeah, went so for just one track similar across. <laughs> yeah yeah similar <laughs> vibes yeah i know so yeah check out that it's gonna be pretty cool we can't wait to see all of you engaging with us on this and having a good old time picking our favorite as monkey song during the world cup and christmas and, what more could you ask for? and if your if your country is in the world cup as well good luck uh, luck, I, I, I particularly, apart from England, of course, I I'll be uh, rooting for for the Canadians. I think. Well, I normally nice have... not the Welsh. No, soft, soft I'd, not, I'd, not, I'd, <laughs> <laughs> I'd normally I'd normally go um, I'd normally go Italy, but of course they famously didn't qualify for this World Cup. So <laughs> I'm going to go. Um, I, actually, Korea in there, aren't they? And my 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 favourite son, Hong Min. So maybe I'll support Korea. Oh, of course, yeah, he's playing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, is he? That's the question. Will he be? He's turned into some mad World Cup chat now. We've got this out. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, no, I'll, um, yeah, so you look out for that on socials that week, and we look forward to engaging and having some banter while we're doing it with you all as well um, during the World Cup yeah. and Christmas. Very exciting. We'll be drunk a lot, so I'm sure we'll be engaging thoroughly with you all. That sounded creepy, didn't it? Sounded sexual. No. Nope. It does now. Did it not? It does now that I put that on it. I'm always doing that. This is this yeah. is what all the court cases yeah. are about. I put my foot in it again. Um, <laughs> anyway, anyway, yeah, thank you for listening and watching. And yeah, let's have some fun with this World Cup. Yeah, let's. Bye.